in this question it is about a rocket propulsion problem okay so we are given a few um, quantities okay so the initial mass of the rocket okay mi is equal to 2.55 times 10 to the 5 kg okay and then uh, it burns fuel uh, for 250 seconds and the rate of burn okay or the the rate of consumption of fuel is uh, 480 kg per second okay so there are three parts in the question we want to find the rocket's thrust and uh, also the mass of the and the speed of the rocket after 250 seconds we are also given that the uh, the speed of the exhaust products relative to the rocket is 3.27 kilometers per second okay so in part a to find the thrust Okay, we'll be using T equals to R times V relative. Okay, so thrust is equal to 480 times 3.27 times 10 to the 3, and you get 1.57 times 10 to the 6 newtons. Okay. Okay, next in part B, uh, to find the mass of the rocket after 250 seconds. So, so it's just um, the initial mass of the rocket minus uh, the rate of consumption of fuel times time. Okay, so you have uh, 2.55 times 10 to the 5 kg minus 480 times 250. Okay, you calculate this, you get 1.35 times 10 to the 5 kg. Okay, so this is the mass of the rocket after 250 seconds. And part C, you want to find the uh, speed of the rocket after that. Uh, so we'll be using Vf minus Vi is equal to V relative times natural log of mi divided by the initial mass divided by final mass okay so uh, the rocket starts from rest so the final speed will just be uh, v relative times natural log of mi uh, divided by mf okay so we have 3.27 times 10 to the 3 times natural log of okay 2.55 times 10 to the 5 divided by uh, 1.35 times 10 to the 5 okay so 2.55 times 10 to the 5 is the initial mass and 1.35 times 10 to the 5 is the final mass okay and so you calculate this thing you get 2080 meters per second okay so this is how you attempt uh, this question and that's all for this question